Hi YouTube, my name is Chris again. How are you guys on YouTube tonight? I'm going to show you how to take a part of the mag. This is my three cell mag flashlight I bought a long time ago. But to show you, it does work. But to show you how to take it apart, all you need is a young key. So let's go ahead and take it apart. And I'm going to also put it back together and show you how it all comes back. First things first, you got to take the tail cap off. You got to take the tail cap off that uh, spring and it has the bolt inside it. Let's put that off to the side. And I'm saying it's just for yourself. One battery though. Two battery. And there's a third battery. One, two, three batteries. And the head takes a couple minutes to unscrew. But it does come off eventually. But I'm not taking the whole, I'm not going to take the whole mag apart. I'm just taking apart uh, the switch and the lighting assembly on the, on the Mac. Now, the way you get the button is the little button now. Comes off. Unscrew the cap. Bulb. It's off. And by the way, uh, don't take your mag apart because you may um, have a warranty on it, but I don't have a mine. Well, that is what I'm taking apart for you guys today. And what you do, the switch is a bit tricky to get out. But it will come out. Be careful. Don't lose the tiny screw. Like that, that's the set screw. Hold it in place. Don't lose that. And the switch comes about just like this. Careful, you don't have a spring inside. It's a little spring now. Next, I'm pulling out contacts. Do I lose it? Stay on contact. And the stuff I'm pulling out. I don't know. This is the switch itself. We got one, two, yeah. And you got the uh, that and that middle plate. Just don't. These are available. Don't lose any of the bolts. That uh, pain in the butt. Put that together. Next, one, I'm taking the bolt. Is the light. <laughs> it's the same screw. Oh, well, not the same screw, but the same Allen key. That screw, don't want to lose that screw again. Put that off to the side. Alright. It comes right up. Pull it gently. You should have. A spring in this metal contact though and of course this goes inside of the uh, metal thing like this and all you do is it comes right out just like that 
And of course, it's a non metal piece, so you can see it in the hand. And you get the insulator out. All you do is just take your own key. This is the uh, insulator. This is a light cable. Now I'm going to show you how this all goes back together. Like I said, I don't have a warranty on mine. But, you know, if you guys don't have to take your apart and clean it, this is a good way to do it. Uh, take this part. Put these two uh, parts back together like this. Take the cap. Oh, my string went too. It's... Uh, yeah, that's the last time. I don't lose your spring. Take your cap. Put it on the end of the spring like this. Place it on there. Take the spring and that. Like that. And the arm piece I'm going to show you is this arm flat piece. Fill in the end of the spring, just like that. Now, uh, the uh, turkey part is putting this all back together, but it can go all back together in one piece. How do you figure out the that and that goes? I have to get it like this. And that what makes your light bulb go up and up. And then you blow screw. Just like that. Goes back in that little hole. Over there. And of course, if you don't want it too tight, because if, if you make it too tight, you might uh, strip the frame on your on your threads. I'm gonna put the switch back together, and that's all this little parts and pieces of other thing. So far, I'm gonna turn on and take the Look cool. See, now I'm taking the metal piece, the plastic, the clickle, the on top, putting it back in the this tube here, and inserting it urgently. And sometimes, if you get like this, sometimes you have to push it back in. And to take your two metal contacts, those are your contacts right now, metal things. Put them back in the spot where it clicks. Like that was one, it's two. Now the spring goes back in there. That of course your mag might be different than mine. All you do is you stick the insert, put the switch, back in there, click it, here it click, and it should sound like that. And this is always the trickiest part. Is that little screw needs to go back in that hole like that. But uh, you could put it back in there without losing it, but it fits right back. Uh, take these, take your switch assembly, stick it. You might have to adjust the uh, the uh, nut and the switch to go back into the socket, just like that. Now, of course. Make sure your switch is compressed down because if it's not compressed down, 
It would not go back into the cylinder. Put your tube, your cylinder, your thing like this. Go get shape. It should just come right in, just like it did. Spin it like this. Go and see it in now. Take your own key. Screw the own knee. Yeah, own key. Hold on. And some difficult though. Not only I get it all back together in one shot. Yeah, I don't know what's going on now, guys. Yeah. Some difficult areas. Hey, hold on, I don't know why it's not screwing in. Hold on, guys, sometimes this might take a minute or two. Uh, I may have my switch, and apparently I do have my switch backwards. Now, that kind of stinks. Hold on, guys. I got this backwards, I think. There we go. I got my string clip back off. I don't know why I don't want to go back on. Hey, and I got it started. Oh, right, guys, I'm having some difficult issues here with the, putting it back in now. Normally, ash ah, nickels. Normally, it goes. Nicely in the tube sometimes it just depends on how it goes and how I guess Because don't bend up your mat your spring in your mat or whatever All right, there you go I'm sorry, we're well, not redoing it again That thing back just like this slide all the way in Give it a good shake. I'm sorry, it did not go to go the first time like it planned on. And only I don't have trouble putting the mag back together, but sometimes it may work. It pretends now I'm gonna take the little stopper back. But no other stuff where you have to kind of like mush it in now. And by the way, make sure you turn off the switch before you put your light bulb back in it. And mine is a OD 3 watt OD bulb. Putting that back in, putting the locking call back on. And the tip and the head, I'm putting the head back on as well. Wow! Ah! Sometimes with all these uh, metal, the metal uh, flashlights, they all pretty tricky to get back together. But after you get them, after you get your flashlight back together, it should look like that. Input one, two, three cells. These in your flashlight. Go ahead and yeah. Press the spring. 
and it should work just like this. But all it takes to take it apart. See, look, I don't key like this. I don't know what size it is. Sometimes it has written on the on hill, but I don't know what it is. But that's how you put your mag, three cell flashlight, and back together again. And I am sorry if it got jammed up when I was trying to put it back together. Yeah, yeah, this is a three cell, three watt LED. But all right, thank you for watching my video. Wait and describe my videos if you like it. Give me a good uh, thumbs up or not. You know. All right, guys. Peace out. Bye.